I'm just massaging my legs a little bit, um, massaging my IT bands and um, kind of just making sure I stay in good shape for the whole race. I am, um, yeah, it's, I mean, no matter how high tech prosthetic legs are, you're still running in carbon fiber on pipes that are bolted together. So the feet are really high tech. I mean, the whole concept of prosthetic legs are high tech, but when you really look at it, it's carbon fiber that's wrapped around, say, like my calf muscle and everything below the knee. And then it's pipes bolted together. And then the foot is uh, three layers of carbon fiber that come down together and they give a little bit of a spring. So when you put energy into it, you get energy back. But I mean, nowhere compares to the normal foot as far as like the ability of a normal foot, like being able to stand in place and jump and get a lot of energy. Even the best prosthetic foot can't really give that to you. But um, so it, t it takes a lot of the rest of my body to compensate um, kind of for the lack of movement from my legs. So I just have to really stay on top of it. I have to make sure that my quads and my T-bands and my hamstrings and everything are stretched out uh, because they work really hard when I'm, uh, when I'm running. I'm already tired. I have such an appreciation for the human body. <laughs> yeah. You know, once you, once you lose a piece and you realize just how important it is and how perfect it's put together, you know, nothing really can replace the human body.